I'm Richard Furry, and then I, um, I study in Holland here. Okay. Yeah. What, what do you study? I study carpentry. Yeah. yeah. And uh, what story did you tell? I was saying something about Nancy, and then as I was saying that um, he has his wife and then a child. So in that village, he think that he have, he's a very intelligent, intelligent person in that village. So he tried to put, um, he went and bought a pot and then trying to put all the sense that he have inside. In other, nobody will have sense than him. So when he tried to climb the tree and then go and hide um, the sense, so he put the pot in front of him on his stomach. When he was trying to climb the tree, he couldn't make it. And then finally, the son saw him trying to climb the tree with, together with the pot in front of him. So the son said to him, Father, it was better if you put the pot on your back and it would be easy for you to climb the tree. So he said to, uh, to his son that, yes, you are right. That's what I was saying. Yeah. How did you get to know this, this story? Uh, back in Africa, normally back in Africa, some years back, we're not having light over there. So during the evening time, our grandmothers will gather all of us and then sit down on the floor and then he begin to talk the announcer story. In, in order not to go outside so that nothing will happen to you, and then he will gather everybody and then he begin to tell the announcer story so that before you realize it's time, then you have to go to bed. Yeah. So I'll start by my grandmother. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Welcome.